Podcast. What's up, guys? Jay Thorne, sixty-four. It is. Uh, I think it's November twentieth, twenty fourteen. It's Thursday, and uh, tonight. I hate to call him president. Obama's going to talk about immigration reform. And then I just, man, I just got a bad feeling he's fixing to screw something up. And let me just say this from my point of view. If Mexicans want to come across the border, if people want to come from Australia, wherever you want to come from, all I'm asking, and I think most of America, is just saying, do the legal paperwork to get here. And you're going to say whatever you're going to say behind this statement. But if you're trying to swim across the Rio Grande and hide yourself, what are you trying to hide? Why not just go to the the legal system and get it done why be so shady what you hiding you want to be an American come on over here and be an American but go to the legal process at least like no you ain't got all kind of funky diseases hell I see I ain't speaking for all America but I think uh I think a lot of people would give you that opinion. I don't care if you come. Just do it legally. Don't show up here illegally. And then expect health care. Free food. Free crap. You know. I say people. Uh, hard to make that comment without being sounding racist. <laughs> But you got people coming in and opening up these stores. What they get, like five years tax-free to start their business? You bastards won't even do that for Americans. Because I've, I've had my own business. And you tried to kill me at every turn. Health department. I mean, it's just... It's just a chain reaction of crap you got to go through to even start a business. And at the end of the day, you're going to spend the first year, two years of your business paying for that crap. But you'll let other people, oh, I almost said it, didn't I? But you'll let other people come over here and do it for five years tax-free and help them do it. Where's the American incentive I haven't seen all these other countries inviting Americans over and giving them five years of free crap. Why do we do it? But now, we walk in our own stores, and this might sound racist, but I'm going to go forward with this. And now you walk into their store, and you're getting eyeballed the whole time. Maybe it's because my hair is long. Maybe well, whatever reason it is. But you eyeballing me up in your store for no reason. <laughs> and it's in every little small town. No, don't fuck me, my friend. I'll fuck you also. Don't give me that shit. So where's the incentive, guys? Where's the incentive for Americans to prosper? To start their own little business, you know? We're not talking corporation. We're talking, you know, side money projects, you know? But you're going to tax the crap out of us for that. And you're going to whip us at every turning point. To the point where we don't even want to do it. Or I got to break the law. Just where you don't molest me. Trying to start it. It's always something, man. 
We help everybody else but our damn selves. Immigration reform. We ought to stand up and put a foot down. At some point in history, today would be a good day. And say, you know what, Obama? You know what, big business? You know what, big government? You're done. People are taking back over the country. No more pen and cell phone manipulation. You don't use you don't use the Congress, you don't use the Senate. You just say fuck it. I'll do what I want today. All this is gonna catch up with you. Sooner or later. And all you crooked politicians and crooked big business people, y'all have to answer for it one day. By somebody greater than the people. And I wish I could be a fly on the wall when that happens. Because I bet you're going to have a lot to answer for. But since the sun done tucked in behind the clouds, it done got cold. <laughs> Jake Thorne, 64, I'm out.